Hello, everyone. This is Hoi, or you can call me Catherine. Today, I would like to discuss about an early childhood issue: independence versus too much support. I'm sure this is a question for most of the parents. My child is independent, but am I still giving my child too much support? First, there are a lot of studies showing that being independent is a big milestone of growth for a toddler. Early childhood is a stage from birth to the ages of eight. In this stage, children have their most tremendous growth from a baby to a toddler, and then be a young child. They learn a lot in this stage. They grow from crawling to walk, from making sense to talk. They gain new life experiences every day. This is what making parents be so proud of their child each day. But how can parents be a better supporter to their child's growth? Many studies prove that independence is important in children's early age. It promotes children's confidence, self-esteem, and self-trust. It also helps to develop children's social skills that they need in school. Children will be so proud of themselves when they are able to be a decision maker of their own. They can practice being responsible for their ideas and actions. They gain a sense of responsibility. A sense of achievement and success because of their own actions. It is self-motivated and able to collaborate with parents on guidance, support, and trust. This can support the children's growth even in their later teen age. Active learning is one of the popular and well-believed education ways in nowadays. It requires the child's self to explore and experience. It requires a lot of interacting with people, ideas, events, and construct new understandings. No one else can have experiences for the child, but children must do this for themselves. I'm a mom of two boys. As a traditional Asian parent, I love to be there for my boys. I believe I'm helping them in all the ways that they need. After being a classroom teacher, I start seeing myself from my parents in class. I always tell the parents, "Let them do it. They can never learn if you do that for them." But wait a minute! I am doing the same thing as them. I start thinking: Am I giving my boys too much support? Am I eliminating their abilities? Doing everything for them does it really mean I love them? So, what is enough support? And when should I start my overprotecting? From my own classroom experience. I know toddlers are ready to be independent, so this is what happened in my classroom. During morning drop off, my four years old students are asked to unpack themselves. It is their job to take out their homework folder from school bag and put it into the homework folder bin. Then they have to take out their water bottles and snack box and put them in the cubby. Take off their coat and hook it with their school bag inside the cubby. It is a routine that they are doing every day. Parents are not allowed to come into the classroom to help them due to the protocol. Before pandemic, no children had a chance to practice this because parents already done everything for them. That was why we never realized they are capable to do this until we back from pandemic. I believe this is a good thing for teachers and parents to learn about. Also, from a research. I find that starting in early childhood age is the best timing to introduce the independence to a child. Starting at the ages of two, children can be given some simple tasks and responsibilities. For example, clean up the table after they eat, put their shoes away when they're back home, put their dirty clothes in the laundry bin, or even put their water bottle in the kitchen for wash. All these tasks are simple enough for toddlers to achieve and not harmful. It becomes their responsibility to take care of themselves. When they make a mistake, parents should show their okay and respect. It is because this is how the children learn from mistakes. Parents' encouragement is also important to children for the sense of trust. After a child is familiar with the self responsibility, their mindset will be more rational, and it helps for their critical thinking skills. It also helps for their emotional self-management. So, being independent is important and beneficial for a person to start in the early childhood age. 
Children need the skills of independence as the key element and the foundation of their basic skills to help for lifetime growing. Thank you.